Hi! You won't hurt me, will you? Please help me. I hid in this wall from a scary winged demon and now I can't climb out. Can you think of some way to help me? I'm so cold and scared. Thank you so much for saving me. I'm Fiora. See that mountain far away? That's the volcano Mount Bashar in the Dark Lands. There's a fortress there with statues. I was playing there as usual, but today something really scary happened. One of the statues came to life. I got so scared that I ran away without looking back and hid in this well. Um, and who are you? You're just so pretty. What? From another world? Oh, great! Welcome to the Lost Lands. If you want to learn more about our world, talk to my great-grandpa. He's the elder of the Druid Guild. It's not far from here in the forest. The village gates are locked, of course, to keep strangers out, but my great-grandpa gave me this password. Oh, this is my picture! I drew my favorite doll. Her name is Blossom, but I dropped her into the well when I hid from that winged demon. The picture's all I have left now. sitting by the fountain. I can't believe my eyes. It's you. Remember me, Maren? It just so happens that we need your help again. Oh, where to start? This morning, a harpy attacked us. It has been petrified for ages, but it came to life today. Anyone who might have been able to protect the lost lands has either run away or perished, or is busy tending the wounded. There is no time to discuss the nature of this monster, or where it came from. You will learn in time. But for now, please go to Mount Bashar. Fiora will show you where the petrified demons rest. Take a good look around that place. I want to know how that harpy managed to free itself. I'll stay here in case it returns. One more thing. If you find any gold, do not touch it, no matter what. That gold is cursed. One of our brothers wounded the harpy with this spear. Her blood is on the weapon. This is our tavern. It suffered the most damage from the harpy's attack.
This is the Relic Repository, our most precious place. <laughs>